nobody does these ceremonies better than the Mariners. That trend continues tonight, and it's so great to see Edgar in Cooperstown, and just as great to see him address the fans a little more personally here at home. Yeah, thanking the fans. I thought the reaction when he came in from center field by mm -hmm. the fans was terrific. Of course, seeing the highlights the whole way. And to hear Edgar Martinez Day, a lot of good things happening here. I think the fans have already been a winner as we honor number 11, Edgar Martinez. Long time in coming, and it's finally happened. He's in the Hall of Fame. Right now, the business at hand is game two of this three-game set. Well, taking the mound to open this up for the Seattle Mariners is right-hander Matt Whistler. He will be opening his fourth game. You see the overall season numbers, 2-2, two and two, 4.82, and 37, and a third innings. And the 3-1 on the way to Meadow swung on on a pop-up into shallow left field. Coming in is Lopes. Tim is there waiting, and he makes the catch, and that will retire the side. Nice start for Matt Whistler. One over the last couple of years has been one of the best pitchers in baseball. Charlie this year, 12 and 4 with a 2.770 ERA. Broken bat, tough play. Kiermaier, long run in. Kevin Kiermaier on his horse, makes the catch. He had to run a mile to go and get that thing, and he did it. He is never boring. He is <laughs> never boring. I'll tell you, speed to burn. He's got a flair for the dramatic. He likes to church things up a little bit. And how about this sliding grab? And now the Mariners have runners on at first and third with one away. And here is left fielder Tim Lopes. Sliced into right. Garcia is able to make the catch. Here comes Seeger as Garcia has to help himself up. Kyle Seeger scores on the sacrifice fly to right field. Off the bat of rookie Tim Lopes. And the Mariners grab an early 1 0 lead. This is Malik Smith leading off against Charlie Morton. And Smith hits with high in the air. Deep center field. Kiermaier, a long run, racing back, jumping, and making the catch is Kevin Kiermaier. Oh my goodness, that's two tonight. Going back, a little early jump right there. Protect himself. Sees that ball, go get it. Go high point it and protect yourself going down into that wall. What a play, taking away extra bases. And when you're talking about Malik Smith, he doesn't get back there and make that play. That's at minimum a triple. And now the Rays have runners on at first and second with nobody out. Brings up catcher Mike Zanino. Pitch on the way to Zanino. Swing and a high drive deep in the air left center field Broxton heading back to the wall happy homecoming Mike Zanino with a three run homer and the Rays take a 3 1 lead in Seattle. Oh has that got to feel good for the former top round pick of these Mariners he puts the Rays on top three to one back to the top of the order it's Kiermaier Kiermaier gets into one hit deep to right center field Kevin Kiermaier goodbye. I think he's having a night. I was just going to say MVP of the game so far. I mean, come on. I know Zanino's blast was huge, but between the offense here and the defense we've already documented, Kevin Kiermeyer putting on a show. How well he got on base. You know, 0 for 385 is a pretty tough stretch. As second base hit tonight Triple. from Alex Smith. Second for extra bases. Alex making the turn and he will find third base standing up. He has doubled and he has tripled. Here's J.P. Crawford as a hitter. First pitch swinging right down to first. They will let the run score. And Darnell will just get the out there with a 4 1 lead. Now it's 4 2. Narvaez, a high deep drive out to center. Kiermaier can do nothing about this one. Gone. Mariners are within a run. Omar 17th. This is great to see after the four spot from the Rays in the fifth inning. You were wondering what was going to happen with Charlie Morton on the mound, and how the Mariners would respond or answer to it. One of the best pitchers in the American League to come right back and score a couple of runs. I think Garcia is going to lead things off. Garcia swings at the first pitch. He hits a line drive rocket, and it's out of here. Inspired by the water fountain drinking cat, Avisael Garcia goes deep. That didn't take long. That was Sayo Garcia. Boy, he times that up and launches. I mean, there wasn't a guy on the field that 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 flinched. I mean, there was a little bit of a token by Broxton there to kind of jog out towards the wall, but that ball got out of here in a hurry. 2-2 two, two here, two low, swung on, hit up the middle, base hit into center field. Coming around third is Nola. Kiermaier bobbles the ball twice, gets it back in. And the Mariners have closed the gap. It's a 5-4 ball game here in the sixth inning with two outs. Over the second straight night, the former Mariner, Emilio Pagan, is on to work. And here we go. In the ninth, Pagan will deal right down to first. One pitch, one away. 
One ball and two strikes. The stretch, and here he comes. Swing and a miss. He struck him out, and the Rays have the Mariners down to their final out. One strike away, and he got him. The God gets the save. The Rays get the win.